Welcome back to another episode of Saturday Afternoon Gaming. I'm your host, Gaming J, and today we're hopping into Battle Wheels on the Atari Lynx. And wouldn't you know it, this is another game set in the year 2019. What is going on? Um, we've, we've been playing a lot of racing games. Well, we had Outrun 2019 uh, like a week or two back. Uh, and now we have another racing game. This one is more of like a post-apocalyptic, uh, deserted city, destruction derby, Mad Max kind of thing. Um, this is the premier vehicular combat game on the Atari Lynx. And, well, it's the only vehicular combat game of the Atari Lynx that I actually know about. Um, who knows, maybe there are others, but I gotta imagine this is one of the only ones. I don't think the Atari Lynx had a very deep bench in terms of games. It was, um... You know, it was a system that tried to compete with the Game Boy and the Game Gear, and as I understand, it was not super successful, but I don't actually know tons about the Atari Lynx. I think this is only the second Atari Lynx game I've ever played. I'm not playing, by the way. This is the computer showcasing the game, so you can see it's a first-person driving uh, combat game. And, uh, yeah, the Lynx is a bit of a, myste um, a mystery to me. So, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and give this puppy a shot here. Um, <laughs> what is happening in that combat? Oh man, that combat actually looked a little lame. It was just like aim at the car and then press shoot until the other guy dies. Alright, so without further ado, Battle Wheels and the Atari Lynx. So we have a series of options here. We can, I believe, turn radar on and off. We can set the number of kills. A hundred kills? Oh god, that would take forever. Let's set this down to five. Um, the number of cybers. So this is interesting. There are AI in the game. And they're called Cyber Brains. So you can have any number of opponents you want, up to five. So we're going to pick uh, five. Now you can, it says single here. This game, interestingly enough, had multiplayer features. Um, I believe the Atari Lynx had some kind of connection cable. I don't 100% know. Uh, I remember reading that. Oh, I'm just look, looking at my notes here. I didn't jot it down. But I remember reading that. You have cash, so you can like... Uh, buy upgrades for your car. Let's start with 40,000 cash. There's uh, different levels. Dark Lord, Destroyer, Knight, Master, Pro, or Rookie. I'm going to start this one on Rookie just because I don't know what I'm in for. There's Action Mode and Custom Mode. Don't know the, the difference there. And then there's a different maps. Um, so let's go with, just go with Randomize because why not? Um, once it comes back, Dead City. There's quite a few maps actually. And then I guess you can, like, change your characters. I kind of like that, like, punk guy. Uh, this guy here. And you can change your car, too. I like the blue one. Oh, yellow's cool. Black. Oh, man, there's lots of cool cards. A number of options here, which is kind of cool. Select your class. Uh, wait, 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 wait. You could be a heavy car, a light car, a medium car, a, a light... Or sorry, a light heavy. Wait, heavy, light, heavy, medium, light, basic... Or on foot. That's not that's not vehicular combat. That's just dudes fighting. That's just we're we're getting the the vehicular out of vehicular combat. Let's go with medium. Why not? I don't know what the different classes uh, do. Oh yeah, and there's like a TV TV crew. So this game is kind of like um it, it's kind of like Running Man in that this is like some kind of like death sport that is put on TV and stuff. So hold on, if you hold the button, okay, we're at the bottom, oh, we're like driving towards the outskirts, so we want to do like a 180. Okay, we're like the blue car there, I don't know if you can see it. And there's going to be, oh, there's another car coming up, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, oh, we like slammed right into him, shoot, 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 oh, we killed him, oh, and the, the driver flew out and everything. <laughs> Alright, there you go, that was vehicular combat. So this, the target Lynx only had two buttons, basically. One button brings up the radar, the other button shoots. And shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, we killed another guy too. Oh, look at them all. Look at them all. Okay, we're, we're out of bullets, I think. Or no, we still have them. We still have them. Oh, God. There's like a tree in the way. I can't fight. Drive. Run away. Shoot, 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 shoot. I want, I want to like switch guns and stuff, but like I don't have a, I don't have time to do this. Oh, look at all the cars, man. All right, let's get away from this. Anyway, the Atari Lynx only has two buttons. So one button to shoot and the other button you hold it and you can press like different things. So, like, you can see under your car, behind your car. Um, oh, God, he's killing me. Oh, and he got me. All right, so, so that was uh, that was Battle Wheels. Um, we'll give this another shot here. A to continue. And off we go. So, okay, I have the description for Battle Wheels written down here because I thought it was awesome. Um, so here, here it is. 
In the year 2019, humanity has turned more and more to more and more dangerous games for its entertainment, new technological advances, and a massive reorganization of the nation's political structure has given rise to a new breed of spectator sports. The popular, the most popular of these sports is battle wheels and arena. A uh, combat duel between two to six warriors. The cars are high-tech, heavily armored, and ready to party. The drivers are afraid of nothing. Your job is to go into the arena, rock and roll, and get out in one piece. Welcome to the world of Battle Wheels. <laughs> I love that. Your job is to rock and roll and to get out in one piece. The cars are ready to party. It's just awesome. Also, eerily... Eerily, like, on the mark with the whole, you know, the nation's political structure has collapsed in the year 2019 and everything, you know, like, given America's current political situation, all the chaos that constantly ensues, um, that, you know, I mean, we're, if, if only an apocalypse had happened, I could have believed battle cars would be a thing. Okay, we died on Rookie. I don't know what happened there. There was some kind of, uh, there was some kind of celebration and we were clearly last. So, let's, let's do this. Let's do a mono, um, let's try a mono, a mono match, okay? And we're gonna go for heavy cars, why not? I don't know what the difference is, maybe it's just the amount of armor on the cars. And, um, okay, so he's like to our left. Let's go get this guy. Um, the radar like really just lets you know like exactly where to go. Like I'm pretty sure that's him. We're just gonna start shooting in the distance. Come on! By the time we see him, he'll be dead. Boom! And he's dead. <laughs> okay, hold on. There's a way. There's a way to get out of your car here. So, oh, we won the round. Okay, but while we're going to round two, so hold on. Press L and a direction. Uh, L. Oh, L and up and down let you change weapons. So that's something. So there are different weapons. Option two to bail out of car. Um. What, 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 wait, 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 what just happened there? What just happened there? Okay, there, there's a way to get out of your car and go on foot. Yeah, look, okay, so there's my car. There's my car, can I get back in? Oh, you can! <laughs> so, if, if for some reason your strategy involves little, literally running out of your car, you can do that, that is a thing that can happen. Maybe when the car is about to be destroyed, it makes sense to bail. Um, I kind of want to like try this on the on the opponent. I want to like get near him and then jump out of my car and see what he does. He's like stuck on the building. See that? He's, he's just like literally driving into the buildings. The AI in this game, I guess, is not very good. All right, here we go. Jump out of the... Get, get out of the car. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Get out, get out. Oh, God, what is the button? I think I just paused the game. I did. Get, get, get out. Okay, we're out of the car. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, hold on. Okay. <laughs> We're we're out of the car. Where is he? Oh yeah, come on, buddy. You want to kill me? You want to kill me? I, I don't want to get back in my car. I want to see if I can destroy his car while I'm like on foot. Oh, we did it too. We did it too. We don't even need a car, man. On foot is the way to do it. So we, we just won. We won two rounds. Uh, how's that for being good at this game? All right, let's. I'm I'm really tempted. Oh, this is an interesting arena. I'm really tempted to um, try a whole round on foot, and we should we should totally try different guns too, because like this is this is like a joke. Can we just like run it, run him over now? No, okay. We're, we're just dominating this guy. So what are other weapons here? What's this? Ooh, that's like a homing missile. We're totally using that. I'm gonna crush this guy. Oh, he's dead ahead, man. Dead ahead. There he is. Gonna have a few missiles. Have a few missiles. He's doing anything. Kaboom! Oh, they just blew him right up. I love how you... Oh, I think we ran over the dude once we killed him. I love how you see, like, the pilot explode out of the car. It's actually awesome. Um, so we will do we will do an on-foot match um, next. You know what's interesting is normally for these games, I look up, like, little bits of trivia or whatever for, like, a game before we play it. But I could not find anything on Battle Wheels here. Like, like honestly, like there's no Wikipedia page for it. There's I looked for like an Atari Lynx wiki or something. Couldn't find anything. I mean, this is not a game in the Thousand and One book. This is our 
Um, this is actually the last Saturday afternoon gaming that we're going to do. The next video, we're actually going to get back to the 1001 thing. But, um... Oh, yeah, everyone bows. Everyone's cheering at me and throwing stuff at the other guy for losing. How dare he lose? Um, okay, so let's do five cybers. And let's change our car up. Even though we're going to be on foot, we want a cool-looking car. And... <laughs> Does everyone else get cars, just not me, or are like, we all on foot here? So this this is basically no longer vehicular combat. This is just Doom. This is just like Atari Lynx's answer to Doom. I don't even know where... Okay, th this looks like a person. Um, oh, God! They're still in cars! <laughs> okay. Can you, like, hijack a car or something, like Master Chief style? I don't understand what the advantage to being on foot is. So let's see here. So we got we got to play this very cautiously because we're on foot, man. So I think we're in the bottom left. I changed our color to red. So I guess let's just like run really fast and see what happens. Also, we are like running at the speed of a car. We're like, it, look at the cars. They're not going much faster than we are. So here we go. I'm just going to start shooting with my machine gun. Man versus car. This is truly Mad Max style. Um, but yeah, I can't find anything about this game when you like look it up online. There's really nothing. Like I don't, I don't know who made this game. I don't know anything about its production. I don't know anything about how successful it was or sales. Like talk about the Atari Lynx being a mystery. Oh, we ran into the car and exploded. That sucked. Um, oh, there's a tree. <laughs> what? What was that? What was that? Oh, uh, what is this? What is this? Is this a thing? I mean, it's a thing, obviously. Oh, he just ran into it. Okay. So, here's my new strategy. Let's just wait it out. Obviously, let, let's let them all kill each other. And then we'll kind of, like, make our move. So, we have a bit of time to talk here, guys. Um, but, yeah, I have no idea, guys. I have no idea anything about this game. If any of you guys know about Battle Wheels, I'd be really curious to know. Um, I'm just trying all the buttons here. Um, oh, we have different weapons. No, we only have the one weapon. Oh, we... Interesting. Okay. So we have unlimited bullets, I'm imagining. Alright, good. We're off in the corner. They're all fighting to the death down there. We're gonna try and stay very neutral in this. Very neutral. Um, yeah, so the Atari Lynx only has a couple buttons, so it's like, it, it reminds me of how, like, old Commodore 64 games, you had to double up on buttons. Like, if you held a button and pressed a direction, it would do something. It's kind of the same thing here. Like, one button shoots, that's all it does. One button is the radar, but if you press a direction while the radar is up, it does all these other funky things. And there is an L button, and that lets you switch weapons, so. there. I guess there was one more button. Oh god, they... Don't look like they're fighting anymore. They look like they're all just coming to kill me. That's not good. Oh, God, look at them all. What is this? Oh, he's going to run me over. Run. Okay, we, we successfully got not run over. Jeez. Yes. Yeah, you can't kill what you can't hit. Oh, but they got me. <laughs> okay. Now what's happening? Oh, then it just shows... I guess those are like the highlights of uh, the other cars playing after you get killed. I don't know. I don't even know. You know, the first Atari Lynx game we ever played was Toki. And I actually had a ton of fun with that. And that was like a platformer game. I think I was expecting... Oh, God! I was expecting more from Battle Wheels here for there to be more gameplay. Like, it's, it's basically just endless deathmatch. And I suck at it. <laughs> I like how we all get trash thrown at us. Everyone except the... The number one winner guy just gets garbage thrown at them. All right, so that sucked. So pro tip, don't play this game on Rookie. And I can't figure out how to buy things. So cash, forget about the cash. No cash. And uh, is there anything like, how about we just do one kill? I think, I think that's, that's fair. And you know what? we go back? Oh, I selected on foot again. I was going to say, let's go back and turn off the radar. So it's like a real mystery. But, 
You know, I guess if we didn't have the radar, this game would be, like, virtually unplayable. You just spend forever, like, looking for the other guys. Let's see if we can, like, kill this guy with missiles. Come on, buddy. Come on, come on. Come on! Oh! What happened? Did I die? I don't understand that. Road kill. Okay. Um, and now I'm gonna leave. Uh, I'm gonna leave the good old radar on, and we'll just go with medium. How about that? In our sweet white car. The cars look awesome, actually. The graphics look pretty cool too. Okay, so we're in the top corner. Let's do a 180. And we're going to gun it for the yellow car. See, we're going, we're on the left. We're going straight down for that yellow car. And let's see. Uh, how do we get different weapons? Whoa, what's that? Oh, you can like shoot to your left or right. You can like dump oil. Cool. We're going to go with missiles here. All right. This one's coming for you, bud. It's coming for you. I wonder if we're even hitting them. Yeah, we got him. We should turn the difficulty up. Oh, I love how you can, like, just totally straight up run him over afterwards. All right. Oh, there's another car. You want some, too? All right, we're going to turn the difficulty up and see what happens. Yeah, run you over, too. Yeah, thump, 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 thump. I wonder if, like, on harder difficulties... Like, they must do more than just drive directly at you. I feel like the strategy in this game is, like, pretty basic. Okay, so there's just two cars tangling over there. We're going to show up and ruin their party. Did one of them explode? No, wait, that is one of them. It's so hard to see at a distance. It's like, what am I looking at here? Is that a car or just a collect a glob of pixels? Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, we got that one. Man, we are we're cleaning house, man. We're cleaning house. Come and get some in the world of battle wheels. I'm here to rock and roll and party on. Oh god. I'm out of bullets. Shoot, 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 shoot. Yes, we got him. Okay, we're clearly playing this on too easy uh, a level. We just we we swept the board. We killed everyone. I think maybe like one other dude got in a kill, but otherwise it was all us, baby. All right, let's, uh, <laughs> Dark Lord. I feel like they're just gonna destroy us if we go Dark Lord. How about we just try Master? Let's work our way up to harder difficulties. So we're going with Master here. All right. So yeah, uh, the Atari Lynx was not a system that I ever even have really played, to be honest. Like, I didn't own a Game Gear. I owned a Game Boy growing up, but I knew kids who had Game Gears. And so, oh god, they're like chasing me. I have played Game Gears before. I don't even think I've ever laid my hands on Atari Lynx. There's a game store near me that has a bunch of unopened Atari Lynx games. Like, factory sealed. Um, but it's, it's not like a variety of games. It's like literally one game. Like, I, I don't know the name of it, but like, like Snake Man's Revenge. And it's like, the guy has like 70 copies of Snake Man's Revenge, all factory sealed. I'm sure he just must have bought a crate or something, like when the Atari Lynx, like, uh, was, uh, you know, kind of going out of business or whatever. Uh, but yes, I... Oh god, he's shooting missiles! Oh, they get more advanced, eh? Computer. Die 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 Oh god. Hey there what there's a guy on foot! Look at that! There's a guy on foot just running around! What's he trying to achieve? Oh can we run him over? Oh we totally did! What the heck? Why would you intentionally get out of your car? Oh they killed me. Oh it's worth it just to see there's like a random guy running through the the field. Was he another racer contestant or wait, why did two people win? Are you allowed to have teams in this game? I, I, that, that part didn't understand. I, I didn't understand. Okay. Well, let's, I tell you what, let, let's give Dark Lord a shot. And we'll go for Heavy Glass just to see what happens. I'm, I'm very curious here. What makes this Dark Lord? And like, I, the different classes, it'd be cool if there were like different kinds of cars or something. Like you drive like a Humvee or a tank or something. Or like, you know, motorcycles. But the different classes don't seem to do anything. Oh my god. 
Uh, let's fire missiles at this guy. Oh, this guy got in the way! Oh my god, they're all over here! Maybe the, like, aggressiveness of the, the AI just determines... Or maybe, like, the difficulty just determines how aggressive the AI is. Oh my god, I can't move! Oh, I must be at, like, the back of the... Back of the arena. Come on, die, 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 die. This is... <laughs> you just drive in front of a guy and, like, just literally shoot at each other until one of you dies. Man, there he goes, finally. Also, there's no way to tell, like, how much armor you have other than to just look at the number of, like, cracks in your windshield. So there you go. Wow. So this is the second 2019 driving game, as I said, we've played. We played OutRun 2019 which I intentionally picked because it was 2019. This, I had written down to play, and in retrospect, I think the reason I wrote it down to play around this time was because it's a 2019 game, but uh, when I first looked this up, so I, I haven't been able to find much about this game, but one of the few things I did find is that it takes place in the year 2019. That's straight from the instruction manual. So maybe I'm just smarter than I look, and I ended up surprising myself. Because I was like, whoa, what are the odds? A 2019 game. But now that I'm talking aloud, it totally makes sense that in the past, I just figured that out and made a note for myself to play at this point in time. Anyway, um, I think we're kind of at the end of Battle Wheels here. I mean, as I say, I was, I was hoping for more of a game. But, uh, I mean, there is a game here, but it's, it's very repetitive. And it doesn't strike me that there's tons of strategy to it. Although I could just be bad at the game, which is... 100% possible, but either way, it's sort of like, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. I, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I've, I, I've had my feel of battle wheels. Um, Post-apocalyptic futures, by the way, are never as interesting to me as cyberpunk. Post-apocalypse is cool. It's cool. Like, I'm a big Fallout fan and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, when push comes to shove, I think I like the cyberpunk of OutRun 2019 more than I like the apocalypse. The, like, you know, forbidden wasteland deserts of uh, battle wheels here. So... Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy on foot again. What is he trying to do? What is he trying to do? He just... <laughs> so easy to kill. I didn't even mean to run him over. I think my car just nudged him and he, like, flew off and died. But, uh, yeah. Um, anyway, yeah, I, I guess this has been Battle Wheels. Battle Wheels set in the year. An another vision of the year 2019 that did not come to pass. Thank <laughs> God. Um, imagine being recruited for a sport and just like told you're on foot everyone's gonna be in a car you gotta blow up their cars or they're gonna run you over and that's the sport you know sign me up for baseball please if that's the case um, but yeah this is a game on the Atari Lynx um, I don't know tons about it I couldn't find tons about it and I don't know tons about the Atari Lynx but you know what you know, on this channel, I just enjoy trying random old games. Sometimes they're good, and sometimes they're not so good. I would say this is a case where it was not as good as I was hoping. I was ex hoping for more out of Battle Wheels here. But, you know, if you had this game, I could totally see you, uh, you know, back in the day playing it, and maybe having fond memories, so hey. Nothing against anyone who does enjoy this game, but uh, I think it's a little too basic for me, especially these days. But uh, regardless of that, I still had fun checking it out. And I hope you guys did too. I hope you enjoyed uh, checking out an Atari Lynx game. As I say, this is last Saturday afternoon gaming that we'll be uh, doing, well, just uh, for a little while. I mean, we, we tend to do these on Saturdays. But last few weeks we've been doing them because I've been on break uh, from the 1001 quest because it's sort of been Christmas and New Year's and stuff. But now that is all over and starting uh, on Monday... We have our first 1001 video of the year 2019. So I hope you will tune in for that. And uh, otherwise, I hope you guys uh, all had great New Year's and all that jazz. And I will see you guys soon. All right, until next time, my friends. Uh, don't get involved in any insanely unfair death sports. And uh, I guess watch out for the apocalypse because we are in the year 2019. And every video game seems to say it's coming. So just be careful out there. All right, guys. Peace.